scan on people it's Casey from www.kc-sans.com today's video I'm going to show you how to mix vocals to an instrumental or, in, or a beat whatever you want to call it I got the session from a, an artist called Jordan links are in the description box if you want to check him out on his other sites and stuff so I was given the beat and the vocals and the vocals uh, sound, sound like this Hey, tell these niggas that I'm ready for whatever. More niggas rap than they trap, but I'm special. Got you. And then the beats like this. And together they sound like this. Hey, tell these niggas that I'm ready for whatever. More niggas rap than they trap, but I'm special. So what I've done first of all is done some automation on these vocals. Certain parts was a little bit quiet and the other parts was just jumping up, jumping out a bit too much and I didn't want to use a compressor on that straight away. So I just automated, I think, what else have I got in there? Oh, and yeah, some automation on uh, delays and stuff. So that all that there's just delays, automated delays. So first of all, got the beat. So what I've done with the beat, I put a Transx wide uh, plugin on there from Waves. That was probably to give it a little bit more punch. And if you notice, the beat sounds quite mono, like everything's all in, in the middle. So I've grabbed the BX Stereo Maker and once I put that on, it sounds like this. So for me, I like that because it gives it a bit more, bit more width. And then I jumped on, put the glue on there, the glue compressor. slight compression there and then the R bass 42 Hertz boosting 14.6 and just to give it a bit more bottom end So I've used a pro, uh, the Pro multiband compressor and as you can see I'm compressing some of the low end, some of the low mids and then some of the high mids. And the reason for doing that because I felt it was a bit harsh in the, light, in the high mids and then the low mids needed to be tamed to touch and same with the, the low end, the bass area. So without it, it sounds like this. <laughs> I think that sounds good together. So then we've got Wave C1 compressor sidechain, and I've got like the I've got the DSR initiated, and I'm cutting out around 4K. <laughs> I think at the time I'd done it, I probably it probably sounded a bit harsh to me, so that's why I wanted to, to get rid of that little 4K annoyance in there, annoying frequency. And then let's just hear what it sounds like. Cool. And then I've got the center on there. And what I've done is just boosted the sides a touch. I don't think I've touched the middle at all, no. Boosted by 1.7 dBs. Bit more width. And then I've just limited it. Yeah. By a 
couple of DBs. With the vocals, it sounds like this. Hey, tell these niggas that I'm ready for whatever. More niggas rap than they trap, but I'm special. Got you a degree now, what you gonna be now? Is it so bad that I want something better? Than a typical nine to five. Now, if you hear the vocals, they don't, they're not, they ain't really cutting through, so that's when I'll just put a few plugins on and change a few things. So, first of all, I've got the Pro Q, and I've cut some low end, about 100 hertz, boosted a little bit in the 200 region, and also cut at 170. The reason for me doing that at the time was probably because it was a bit. Hey, tell these niggas that I'm ready for whatever More niggas rap than they Got you I don't think I was happy with how it sounded at the time It didn't sound too bad So I've cut around 300 and near 500 as well And um, let's just boost that 500 see what that sounds like Hey, tell these niggas that I'm ready for whatever More niggas rap than they trap But I'm special Got you a degree now Yeah, so I'm happy with that And then I boosted around 2k And then boosted around 10k as well and then a bit of a high shelf no that's off and with that in it sounds like hey, tell these niggas that I'm ready for whatever more niggas rap than they trap but I'm special so then I bought the the Vox former in and I like to use this I like to enable the presence part of of this plugin and it gives it a bit more grit at the top end I feel hey, tell these niggas that I'm ready for whatever more niggas rap than they trap, but I'm special. Got you a degree now, what you gon' be now? And then I've got the HLS, and I think I've just got this on for just the sound of it. Hey, tell these niggas that I'm ready for whatever. Cause it ain't doing nothing. And then we're moving on to the Kramer Pice uh, compressor. Hey, tell these niggas that I'm ready for whatever. More niggas rap than they trap, but I'm special. Got you a degree now, what you gon' be now? Was it so bad that There's some really light compression going on there because I didn't feel like it needed that much compression. So then I chucked the um, Fab Filter Pro C compressor on there, and that was probably to get some parallel processing going on off here with this knob. Hey, tell these niggas that I'm ready for whatever. More niggas rap than they trap, but I'm special. Got you a degree now, what you gon' be now, was it? And then I've got the Oxford limiter. And the reason why I like to use this is because of this enhanced slider here. Uh, you can hear what it what it does. Hey, tell these niggas that I'm ready for whatever. More niggas rap than they trap, but I'm special. Got you a degree now, what you gon' be now? Was it so bad that I want something better? Than a typical nine to five. I don't fully understand what this limited, what the enhance does, but I like what it does, so I use it. I think I should read up on it, maybe. So yeah, that's all the plugins I used on that vocal, and I'm gonna play it with and without, so you can hear the difference. So I think it's cutting through nicely now and I, I like the way it sounds but for me it's a little bit dry so what I'd like to do is well what I've done here is chuck the a doubler in there Typical nine to five and I was writing rhymes the last time I cried What the fuck is you saying? I'm a grown ass man boy I was fifteen the last time I lied Matter of fact I just That's to give it a bit a bit of width. Then I've got a delay, H delay on there. Typical nine to five and I was writing rhymes the last time I cried What the fuck is you saying? I'm a grown ass man boy I was fifteen the last time don't look like it's doing anything. Probably for slapback. Yeah. That's really low. Okay, and then I've got another delay. 
typical nine to five. And I was writing rhymes the last time I cried. What the fuck is you saying? I'm a grown ass man, boy. I was 15 the last time I lied. Matter of fact, I just lied to my bitch, man. She call her button with another bitch, man. She my kickstand, but I don't trust shit, man. Been here before, I left a nigga so sick, man. Mine on the money, cause these hoes ain't shit. Caught a better bitches bureau, none of these hoes legit. But my, I got a plan for a meal. Penny for my thoughts. Man, that's a steal. Lil' Birdie told me on the low, you got that Vilmatic. Nobody touching cold, nigga, more like real. Okay, so I got on there is the automated delays. I was talking about in the beginning and they sound quite loud on their own but with with the actual track playing the beat playing the song playing it works typical nine to five and i was writing rhymes the last time i cried what the fuck is you saying i'm a grown ass man boy i was 15 the last time i lied matter of fact i just lied to my bitch man she calling but i'm with another bitch man she my kick and then the last one Last scent is reverb. I know a lot of I know a lot of artists, rap artists don't like to use reverb on their vocals, but I think this it works on this one. And here's the reverb on its own. It's really low, so it's hard. And it's quite boxy as well. I'm wondering why I left it so boxy. And together it sounds like this. Matter of fact, I just lied to my bitch, man. She calling, but I'm with another bitch. So what I do, I play play it without, and then I'll drop them back in so you can hear what's happening. My all vocals bus has got a couple of uh, other plugins on there, so I've got the bit crusher. Probably to be, give it a bit more grip. Typical nine to five, and I was writing rhymes the last time I cried. Transient to help shape the transients of the vocals. Uh, a DSR. So this is like the last plugins on of the chain. Typical nine to five, and I was writing rhymes. And then a max bass as well, just boosting some of that low ends just to round out his vocal a bit, so it ain't too thin. And this is how it sounds. Typical nine to five, and I was writing rhymes the last time I cried. What the fuck is you saying? I'm a grown ass man, boy. I was 15 the last time I lied. Matter of fact, I just lied to my bitch, man. She calling, but I'm with another bitch, man. She my kickstand, but I don't trust shit, man. I like what that max bass does. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And a few plugins just to get the the, the beat sounding good, and then fitting the vocals into to the actual beat. And what I would also like to do as well is I'll either use a C6 side chain on the music bus, which will is the actual beat. And then I like to use the the track space. I don't think have I used it. Yeah, track space as well, just to typical nine to five. Give it that bit of ducking. The C six ducks the frequencies. The track space size ducking like a like a side chain compressor. And for me, this these two work well together. I don't. Some people wouldn't use both together. Some would. It's all different. It's however you wanna mix your your songs. So yeah, so I hope you've got something from this video. Just showing you my approach on how I mix or how I've mixed this particular beat, particular song. It's, this ain't always my same approach. More, this is more or less my approach to doing things, but sometimes I would use different plugins on the vocals, like a different compressor or something like that, um, or a different limiter or delays. It all depends on how, this, how I, the song feels and how I think it should sound. 
so yeah like i said i hope you got something from this if there's any questions or anything you're not too sure yeah. about hit me up in an email or just drop no. me a comment i'll try my best to get back to you and thank you for your time i appreciate you watching music is life peace hey tell these niggas that i'm ready for whatever more niggas rap than they trap but i'm special got you a degree now what you gonna be now is it so bad that i want something better 